was about 20 years old when I did my first constellation. At that time, I was did not have good connections with my family. I chose the city to study in that was the farthest away possible. And I did not like to go home. And doing the constellation really shed a lot of light on the situation and changed everything to the point where I love to be around my family. I love to invite them into my home. My mother can stay as long as she wants. She could technically move in. <laughs> and I really attribute this to um, the family constellation work. And it showed me, I think one of the biggest things is it showed me how profoundly connected we are within our system of origin. Uh, I have a big experience. There's something changed in my family with my brother. This big, huge uh, problem for us um, during, since I remember. And uh, now he's great. He's starting to have a a life for himself and it's making it easy for us. Mm. This was a big change. From my childhood that was able to forgive and let go and go on with my life and look at it with an entirely different perspective. You no longer feel like a victim and feel like you've taken back control of your life and going forward and letting the negative stuff that impacted you and kept you from going forward to put it behind you. Mm. and to feel healthy and whole again. That's what constellations have done for me. I learned myself to release blame and release the victim consciousness. Mm. And um, so I, I'm still in the process. But it's uh, it ha like every family constellation I go to is like a little piece of puzzle. So I, I don't see yet the whole picture, but I see that the puzzles start to be in the... On the movements that support um, the heart having ease. Mm -hmm. And there, there's something about the work as we watch people move and watch ourselves move that there are moving, movements that give our hearts ease. Mm -hmm. and, the, and our hearts have their own intelligence. And that's, this is kind of a direct look, kind of communication with the heart in a whole other way. You can watch people's bodies and, and their faces light up in ways that aren't verbal, they aren't about talking. It just, it's a movement. It's like, and you, you, you hear going, <sighs> you know, so that, that's kind of cool. When I am in a representative role, that I have feelings that come up in line with what's going on with the situation for the other person. And it, it's just, it really it amazes me. I'm amazed at my own work and at working on other people's family constellations. Because when I'm working on other people's family constellations, I'm actually sensing an energy field that I didn't even know existed before I was doing this work. And the, this work gives you the, the, the access of being able to experience it and feel it. And um, then you can leave that world again afterwards, you know. Yeah. Uh, but you, are, you gain a totally different understanding and then ability to act in a different way. So. Um, even if one, the, the, the great thing in, in conservation that you don't have to present your own case, but you, just as a representative, you gain just a rich experience and you get always something for yourself that steps you, gives you another step ahead mm -hmm. in your own development search. Right. The morphic feel, this, 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 you know, how much is in it? And um, just by having people be representatives of different aspects of your life and how accurate it is, it, it, that's pretty, been pretty amazing. And how much movement can occur when you engage in this kind of activity of, of kind of looking at what's not being said, what's not present consciously, but is in this field and how how much movement can happen as a result. It's pretty, uh, it's, a, it's such an intelligence, um, there's a, such a, a, um, a grace to it that um, I'm pretty amazed with. Sometimes when I'm away from this completely just at work, meetings in different places, my awareness now is a little bit different than it used to be because of 
paying le less attention to the content of what's being said and more uh, toward what's going on underneath that. It's been helpful. And when I'm not working um, my own issue, it's an extraordinary privilege to get to be able to participate in, in bringing, in restoring harmony mm -hmm. and to swim in deep waters um, whenever you come to a constellation. Us. gives you a chance to give back to the universe, to be there, to be a part of a system to help people heal, and to see the change in people, to see their lives, especially if they're people you work with on a daily basis and do a contact with, and you see their lives turn around mm -hmm. and change, and all of a sudden they have a successful relationship, they get married, they have children, things that they never thought that were totally out of their reach until they did go to the constellations and did see what was stopping them from being the best they could be. And that to me is the greatest gift of all, is seeing that happen. Mm -hmm.